at something over here. I have no health. Oh my fuck. God damn. back down here and there's more monsters I wish the camera would move so I can see Certainly don't mind using my gun down here with how little health I have. Especially with their propensity to fucking crawl around, get back up again. Better be fucking dead. Considering how many times I goddamn shot you. Oh my god, look at how little health I have. Ah! Uh, ha 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 ha! I would like it very much to have an ampule or a first aid kit. That would be great. Alright, well, now I'm gonna get fucking cornered here, so. At least be able to see my enemy as they walk upon me. Right? Are you are you coming? Right now I'm holding down L2 so that the camera follows my motion. Sounds like there are two of them. Where's the other one? Let's just go this way. Keep making progress. My progress is good, and hey, if I don't run into them, there's no chance of me getting damaged, right? Oh, great. This is just a big old, just a big old puddle room. Love to see it. Is there fucking anything down here that he's, can help me? First aid kit, ampule, health drink, please. For the love of God, no? Just monsters. Great. Love to see it. Oh. Until they're coming. There you are. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Go into the inventory to reload because it's faster. <laughs> Using some elite MLG gamer strats right there. These motherfuckers don't know who they're fucking dealing with. I cut my teeth in Halo 3 Legendary Edition. You guys really think that you can get the drop on me? All right, which one did I come out of? Find out in just a second. Did I miss a fucking ladder again? I don't know, probably. Find out if this is progress or not by the sound of my radio, okay. Oh, no, 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 no. Glad I counted correctly there. Coming up again, yep. Please? No, hang, ah! Kind of felt like a badass there. Are they dead? 
better be fucking dead. Okay. How many bullets do I have? I still have an insane amount of handgun bullets, so I think I'm fine for now. I just have no health, for God's sake. I just want some health, please. I don't want to have to start this all over again. That would not... That would not be a good time. Ooh, another ladder. Let's just go up here and be at the ready for some goddamn nonsense. Oh, at least there's a save. At least there's a f goddamn save. I guess I go ahead and save. Even though I have no health. What's this place even called? Labyrinth. <laughs> oh. What a descriptive, what a dis... Glad the description's accurate. I just want, I need to... I need to heal up. Daddy, no. Oh no. Yeah. We're at this part of the game, and I have no health. Oh boy. Oh boy. I have no health, and I'm at a goddamn boss fight, and I'm dead. I'm, I'm dead. I'm dead. Yep. Yep. Oh no. Oh no. Oh. Why aren't there more healing items? <laughs> Well, I heard there are more healing guys. I, I, we can try. I'm gonna give it a. I'm gonna give it. You know, I'm gonna give it a try. Let's see if I can't do this. Maybe switching weapons in the midst of combat is a bad idea. So why don't we go ahead and switch? Let's switch to the shotgun. Actually, I have more shotgun ammo than rifle rifle ammo. And there really is no more healing items. I might have to backtrack quite. A bit. We'll have to say. All right, skipping the cutscene. All right. Oh, f it doesn't stop. I gotta fucking run to the goddamn corner. <laughs> no, ah. Oh. Yeah, there's nothing I can fucking do. That thing is just too fucking strong. Oh, I don't like that imagery. No siree. No. No. Uh. Oh, that's not. Not pleasant. Um. Great knife. Maybe the great knife will guide me. <laughs> Let's try. Let's fucking try the great knife. I have no health. What am I supposed to do? Oh man. How far back should I go, too? Because there are really no healing items. Oh, my God. What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to do? I right, said so this is the cheat screen. Any more? No? 
That's all the cheats. Okay. Oh, man. I don't know. Maybe the handgun. Maybe the handgun will be fine. Maybe the handgun will, like, <coughs> stun lock him or something. It's stained with something that looks like blood and is partially illegible. The of a, the ba of probably body of the man later identified as Thomas Oro Lumberjack, age 39, was discovered in the bum lying. Fa. The probable cause of death is multiple stab wounds, the front of the neck and the left side of the torso by a sharp edged weapon. The estimated time of death was somewhere between 11 p.m. and 12:30 midnight due to the signs of the struggle in the room and the lack of a murder weapon police are considering this a homicide and have opened a murder investigation furthermore given the fact that the cash in the room was untouched and mr room blah, blah, and a history of drunkenness and violence the police suspect that to was not a robbery a crime of passion is probably what that word is saying because that's typically what we say when we say crime of in reference to a non-robbery related crime. I have no idea how I'm gonna fucking fight this boss here. I mean, we're giving it a try. This is why you cycle your saves, my friends. There's nothing I can fucking do. Ah! <sighs> All right, hold on. Hold on, everybody. All righty, we are back, and this time I have two med kits and some health missing uh, what I essentially had to do is just go back and make far more liberal use of my shotgun than what I was doing in the past who would have thought who would have thought such a powerful weapon would be helpful in making sure that I don't uh, this one has today's date that's kind of strange okay plural What I did is I looked up a guide to see if there were healing items, and guess what? There were none to be found in the labyrinth, I'm afraid. So let's go ahead and take a second to take in the environment of this boss fight. Flesh-covered walls with holes in them, with pistons going in and out. The boss here is a bed with two figures writhing all over it. Oh, come on. All right. The guide also said, why? Why, 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 do I have to restart it every time? Oh, my f fucking god. Okay, let's equip the shotgun, I guess. The guide also recommended that I could just use the heavy attack of the... Wow, okay. There's just no hit stun on this guy. Got it. Anyway, what was I saying? Right. Flesh walls with holes in them and pistons going in and out. A boss that is a bed frame with two figures writhing together on it. And then what does... What does she say? What does she say at the beginning of this? Daddy, no. Mmm. Mm-mm-mm-mm. Not... Not fun implications there, I'm afraid. Not fun at all. So... Yeah. Yep. What also doesn't help is the name of this boss is called... Abstract Daddy. Not very pleasant. My god! I was fucking running away. What the fuck? It does so much damage, too. Holy crap. Fucking. Alright. And yeah, why don't I run away faster? Why am I stuck in a corner? Fucking hell! Ugh. Oh. Oh, 
Oh, the recovery is... Why can't I fucking move? Ah! Ah! Stuck in a corner. I don't like that. And I've already used up my healing items. Great. Let's try this. I just got... Why do I slow down? Oh my god. There's nothing I can fucking do and I just get stuck. Do I just gotta keep doing this? You're a lot of help there, buddy. Thanks for all the help. And it just fucking latches on to me. Great. How am I supposed to defeat this thing? Oh my god. I what am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to fucking do? Oh, Jesus Christ. The guide that I looked up, I just looked at it a little longer and it did say the chainsaw would like knock it down, but it didn't seem to knock it down enough. Let's try the chainsaw again, I guess. It's my best bet. It's just, it, I have to reload. I have to fucking restart it every time. Let's try the fucking sword again. Let's do the fucking great knife. I'm gonna keep at this until I fucking beat this boss. I just don't have a ton of healing items. I'll have to go all the way back. I, will I have to restart the fucking game? That wouldn't be great. That wouldn't be great at all. I want to try the sword again. Sword does a ton of damage. Now let's fucking switch weapons, I guess. I don't fucking know, dude. What am I supposed to do here? Now run, 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 run. Oh my god. Yeah, it's just not doing that consistently enough. That's so annoying. Oh my god! It hits me again before I can get another attack off? Are you fucking kidding me? Oh my fucking god. It's gonna hit me again. It's gonna fucking hit me again. Ah! Oh! Did that do it? Oh, thank fucking Christ! Oh. Under the covers, too. Oh, yeah. Angela, relax. Don't order me around! I'm not trying to order you. So what do you want then? Oh, I see. You're trying to be nice to me, right? I know what you're up to. It's always the same. You're only after one thing. No, that's not true at all. You don't have to lie. Go ahead and say it. Or you could just force me. Beat me up like he always did. Oh, you only care about yourself anyway, you disgusting pig. Angela. Don't touch me! You make me sick. 
You said your wife Mary was dead, right? Yes. She was ill. Liar! I know about you. You didn't want her around anymore. You probably found someone else. <sighs> That's ridiculous. I never... So, uh, yeah, not exactly pleasant subject material here. Um, let's look at, let's, yeah, okay, that feels, feels better. So, yes, Angela's father... Oh, Angela's father. There's no beating around the bush here. Angela's father sexually assaulted her. And um, she ends up killing him with the knife that she gave you. And she is clearly feeling some kind of way about it. And that's why she's going through... Silent Hill. And so that little room right there, that was us being dragged into her Silent Hill. And we had to fight, we had to fight her monster being the abstract daddy. And as you can see, she had uh, some, you know, Aversions to us touching her, which is a one of the many ways that PTSD due to sexual assault can manifest. Um, there are other ways. Some some people end up trying to uh, main regain their control of of their body through sexual promiscuity. Um, Others will have just total sexual aversion, and there's so many other things that can, you know, it can be, it's, it's, uh, yeah, how do I fucking talk about this shit? It's hard. It's a difficult subject matter. It's, um... It's handled very well in this game. And this is what I meant by, like, I wish more games had such strong, mature themes as this game. But at the same time, most games wouldn't handle it as well as this game does. So many of them would fail to be able to, you know... make a game from something like this and have it not be, like, insulting. So that's something that Silent Hill 2 does exceptionally well, and it should be commended for it. They're tackling a very, very, very sensitive subject matter, and they do it, I believe, in a tasteful way that doesn't feel exploitive, doesn't feel... It doesn't feel bad, you know? I mean, like, it doesn't feel wrong, you know? It feels bad. It feels bad. But it doesn't feel like they did a bad job. And on that pleasant note, my friends, that is all I have time for today. I think I'm just gonna leave it at that. 
I need a bit of a break. So, uh, yeah, I'll... I'll see you next time, my friends. McFlubber Pants is over and out of this hizzy. Bye-bye, everybody. Mm-hmm.